I'm Ari Payton and this is your update for Sunday, December 12th. Police are investigating after a person was found dead in a burning car in Point Loma. Police got the call around 345 yesterday afternoon and responded to the scene. It happened at Valletta Street near West Point Loma Boulevard. They are still investigating. San Diego police say a bunch of burglars broke into this store by busting through a wall from a vacant unit next door. Investigators say the group stole $1,000 from the Rip Curl store in Linda Vista on Linda Vista Road yesterday morning. As of now, investigators don't know how many suspects were involved. And some California firefighters are on their way to Kentucky to help with the search and rescue effort following those devastating tornadoes. California's Governor Gavin Newsom approved the deployment California search and rescue personnel after re receiving a request from FEMA. Firefighters from Orange County and Sacramento are on their way to help. And the county's redistricting commission held a meeting yesterday, which could redraw boundaries for the county's five supervisor districts. The push would move El Cajon's voting district out of East County to a new district, which includes Hillcrest and City Heights. San Diego brewers are dealing with inflation in what some are calling a pandemic. There's a can shortage brewing because of aluminum. It's in short supply, and that could mean that your next six pack of beer could cost even more. San Diego based brewery Carl Strauss says the demand for cans is higher than ever because seltzers, beers and energy drink makers are using them more now as opposed to bottles, which they say are heavier and not as easy to manage. And tonight, a fun one here, a holiday tradition returns to San Diego. The 50th annual San Diego Bay Parade of Lights kicks off this evening at 5 p.m. Over 80 boats will be decorated in festive lights. The parade begins at Shelter Island, then proceeds to Harbor Island, the Embarcadero, Cesar Chavez Park Pier, and ends at the ferry landing on Coronado. We will continue to bring you the latest news here at NBC7.com as well as on TV, but you can always tune into our podcast today in San Diego. That's where we talk about the day's biggest news headlines and weather. Stay safe and healthy, everyone. I'm Mari Payton. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.